demonstrating six of the most important elements on self-defense. And the first one of the first two is just going into a horse. The elbows at the same time that you learn for self-defense also is a good exercise for the, for the body. And I demonstrate over here, Morote Joko Ijiato, it's cool. <laughs> Or here, both. Still bring more power. 
and pull back. Now, without holding again, on the count of two. One, two, three, and back. One, two, three, and back. And then we switch. And we go this out. One, two, three, and back. Now we're going to hold it over there. And one, two, three, and hold it there. And come on. One more time. Now slowly up and go. And we last over here this is six different elbows done from different sides. And then for example, we're gonna do some of the applications over here with Kevin. We even uh, on this elbow, go up. On this elbow over here, is imagine that you are a squeeze like in a bar, and you have we're standing here, here, and here. And you lift one, and then you drop. Okay, we can say one can be one individual, or it can be two. So if he's striking one, this is the guy, he's striking me, that is one. So we're gonna apply here. Okay, so that part over here will be just attacking one. That means that that's a four, over there. So over here, go up, and then attack with this one. And go. Bang. Now you're going to attack very hard. Go into a hole for the time being. And go. Bang. That's it. This is what strike either the body or the head. Okay? And one more time. And go. Bang. Okay? Right in here. One elbow. If we do two, that would be double. That's okay. This is one. Now, we have another elbow that is a toss. Tossing if you have to get. For example, over here, you turn a little bit around. If this is a punch coming to you, I'm going to say, punch it over here. So, so that I go under and you grab the guy here. Okay, so over here, I'm gonna do it again. This is a punch coming to you. Do I duck? Do I duck in the punch? Do I come in here? Hey! Or boom! Very or imagine that the person is down already and you just go and strike the person with elbow. This is important for elbow strike. And now we have another one that is, that is a mawasi. That is one of the most important because most of the time it happens from here. If, this, if I am mad here, if this guy is resisting over here and I don't want to punch, oh, <laughs> elbow punch. That is mawasi. But also a mawasi there. You see, I cannot punch now. I can dissolve this grab, this grip over here, with an elbow. You see? So go again, you grab me, I cannot punch. But, I can do elbow strike. So he also, you say, the mawasi, you can use it to dissolve a grip. If somebody grab your arm and you cannot punch, those are the, the use the mawasi. Also, like I said, before, I can go here. Then I'm going to demonstrate again. Boom! Let's go cross. The elbow cross. Mawasi is this guy. When you do it, when you apply, you don't have to go over to a wide hand. You can do it just for sure. Close hand. Bam! Okay? Bam! Body and body. We're gonna apply another technique that is a round kick, what we call Mawasi Gen. But we're gonna go to the 
the left. I'm going to go into high round kick. Now, if that means, if it means round kick to the left, we don't have to turn it. To go a, a, a round kick high, yeah. you turn it. Okay? Yeah. See, that's all the left pivot. But when I round kick to the left, you don't have to. I'm just going to use your head over here. Go and squat. Because uh, Kevin is going to squat so here and move so move. And this is an example. Over here, if we are close, I want you to do a round kick to the left. I don't do it that I'm trying to pivot. All I'm doing is dropping the hip. A good kick for, especially for women. That usually they learn how to use it. They have a very hard round kick. And this is the purpose. Round kick to the left, you're using from club. Can be used here. You can use from the back. Are you? <laughs> So these things. Boom. There are many ways that you can use the same kick. But bang. Now, if I'm here and I would do the kick, and I go with the ground kick higher, then I could pivot. See that? This is a point of this. Pivot. Because I'm doing a high kick. And no, very simple. Dropping to the front, to the back of the leg, Burn. to the front. Now, to go back into your place, and we're gonna go with the same drop. The opponent attack you, and you're gonna go slowly, extended to the back. Everyone ready? Ready? And one, two. And three. One more time. One, two, three. And again. The opponent swing I use to step with the body and go forward, raise the leg. Now we're going to go to the other side. Same thing. The opponent swing. And go forward, what we call counter. And lock it. The first thing is to build the leg. You can do it with a, what we call shin bone over here, with this part, or with the instep. Ah! 